Today we are going to try to understand the World Bank, its intro, history, its organizations, structure, objective, goals for future, its result and World Bank versus Pakistan. So first of all we studied about its intro. So the World Bank is an international financial institution that provides loans and grants to the government of low and middle income countries. The World Bank promotes long-term economic development and poverty reduction by providing financial support to help countries. World Bank gives loans for education, health, infrastructure, communication and many other purposes. Like other financial institutions, World Bank does not operate for profit and the president of the World Bank is traditionally an American and the World Bank and IMF are both working closely with each other or based in Washington DC USA and the World Bank influenced by USA because its headquarters is located in USA now we look at its history World Bank was established alone with the IMF at 1944 in Britain Woods Conference and Harry Dexter White and John Maynard Keynes the founding father of the both the IMF and the World Bank and its headquarters is located in Washington DC, USA. And after a slow start, its first loan was to France in 1947. In 1970s, it focused on loans to developing world countries, shifting away from that mission in 1980s. Originally, it established after the World War II when many countries' economy destroyed, half population affected by the World War II, its loan helped rebuild the countries devastated by the World War II and it established to help rebuild the Europe and uh, Japan after war. Its official name was IBRD, International Bank for Reconstruction and Development. There are five organizations of World Bank. The World Bank Group is a family of five international organizations and the World Bank is the collective name for the International Bank for Reconstruction and Development IBRD and International Development Association IDA. Two of the five international organizations owned by the World Bank Group, other three organizations are International Finance Corporation IFC, Multilateral Investment Guarantee Agency IMIGA and International Center for Settlement of Investment Disputes ICSID. Now we look at its structure. The World Bank is made up of 189 member countries and these member countries or shareholders are represented by a board of governors who are the ultimate policy makers at the World Bank. The World Bank has 10,000 workers all over the world and all governors met once a year at the annual meeting of the board of governors of the World Bank group. The 13th president of the World Bank is Dave Melpas. Every president has the term of five years and the World Bank run by the president and 25 executive directors as well as 29 various vice presidents, IBRD and IDA. The US, Japan, China, Germany and UK have the most voting power. There are some objective of World Bank. The World Bank aims known at developing countries to help reduce poverty. The bank is engaged in several global partnerships and take a role in working towards addressing climate change. The World Bank operates in education, agriculture, industries, climate change, disaster risk management and conflict and violence. So the World Bank work for energy, environment, natural resources, gender equality and for water. Now we look at its result. So World Bank Group respond in COVID-19 is targeted in four key areas. First of all, saving lives threatened by the pandemic. Second one is protecting the poor. Third one is helping save jobs and businesses. And Last, not the least, working to build a more resilient recovery. During fiscal year 2011 to 2017, 602 million people received essential health services through the World Bank IDA funds. 
so here are some goals for future the world bank has set many goals for future which one is ending extreme poverty and second one is promoting shared prosperity and end hunger release the human rights of all achieve gender equality and the empowerment of all women and ensure the protection of the plant and its natural resources and its goal is to improve the equality of life and increase the prosperity for people everywhere especially the world poorest the world bank group is communicated to help the government achieve universal health coverage by 2030s which has the potential to transfer the health and well-being of individual and societies now we study about the relationship between world bank and pakistan so pakistan has been a member of world bank since 1950s then the world bank has providing 40 billion dollars in assistance and world bank support the government of pakistan on poverty reduction and to provide financing and technical assistance for both economic and human development so the world bank and other international organization have a central role to play in addressing long-term global challenges but these institutions must transfer themselves and their partnership to have success so the world bank influence over the economy of developing countries through loan conditions and technical assistance and policy blueprints the world bank institute was a global connector of knowledge learning innovation for poverty reduction all institutions of the World Bank Group have collectively adopted these core values impact, respect, integrity, teamwork, and innovation help us focus on how we achieve our vision. So the World Bank provides financing advice and other resources to developing countries in the area of education, public safety, health, and other areas of need. World Bank is an organization which is working for welfare at global level. Its objective is to poverty reduction and share prosperity in achieving its objective in reducing poverty in different regions of the world. And World Bank encouraged to capital investment, encouraged to international trade, establish peace, time, economy or environmental protection and World Bank reduce child mortality, improve their maternal health. It is all about World Bank. Thank you so much.